thank you for clicking on this video um, welcome back to my channel my name is Maddie Iris um, I do purse videos and haul videos and shopping videos that sort of thing so if you like that then you are gonna love my channel um, maybe consider subscribing uh, checking out my other videos I try to post as often as I can I don't really have a set schedule per se yet um, I just kind of post when I have time. So today I'm going to be doing a um, small-ish, not really, I have a bunch actually here. I already did one kind of collection of my Hello Kitty lounge fly bags and that was pretty big. But this one is pretty much like a part one of I don't know how many um, parts I would have of a... Betsy Johnson purse collection. Um, I have a lot of them. Betsy Johnson is my favorite designer. I love all of her stuff normally and when I can get it for a really good deal or if I see something that's really rare, um, I usually will pick it up. Um, most of these bags I'm going to show you guys I got from either places like Marshalls or TG Maxx or I got them from apps such as Poshmark, Mercari, or resellers. Um, there's specifically one on here that I would really recommend to you guys. Uh, her name is Purse Trippin. Um, purse spelled normally and then T-R-I-P-P-I-N with a little asterisk. Um, she is so awesome. I love her videos. And um, you, she does live sales I think almost every Friday and she gets such cute stuff um, so you should definitely check her out hi Kim I don't know if you'll be watching this at all but I hope other people will come to your channel because I really do love your channel so much um, so yeah so getting into my video I'm gonna go ahead and start showing you guys just this big pile I have next to me of my some of my Betsy Johnson's. No particular order again for this, just whatever I pick up. I'm going to show you guys, but yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Um, make sure to leave me a thumbs up if you do, and uh, maybe leave down below a comment of which one is your favorite bag. Um, and yeah, I'm going to go ahead and just launch into it. So this is my first one I'm going to show you guys. This is a super cute tote. There again, this is one I got from Marshalls. I love the chain. Inside has the really pretty floral interior, and I love this hot pink um, leather part as well. It came with a little pouch that's connected to the purse. So that's really nice if you want to carry any like cosmetics or um, little stuff with you. That would be awesome. This one I got such a good deal on it. I only paid $20 for this um, from Marshalls because it went down on the markdown file a couple of times and it finally went down to $20. So that's an awesome deal for a Betsy bag and I just love the, the hearts and everything on it. So yeah, that's my first one. guys have most likely if you've seen my first video you've seen this one but this is another one that I have it is a um, love Betsy by Betsy Johnson um, I kind of talked about that in the other one but love Betsy is kind of a off brand of Betsy not like completely but it is kind of um, kind of like a side thing to Betsy where it's a little bit more inexpensive but they she still makes really cute um, bags for that collection in particular. So yeah, love this one. I got this one offline. This is my next one. I have not used this one yet. Um, super cute. This is one I actually bought off of Kim on Purse Trip in one of her live sales. Super cute. It is a Betsyville. Betsyville was um, 
the collection that Betsy Johnson did for JC Penney um, some years back. They're again probably in the early 2010s, but they're again super cute bags. So yeah, this one's really fun. This little lock in the front. It's functional, it has a pocket. Um, just a giant bag. I thought this would be like a good school bag and stuff. Really pretty hot pink interior. And I love the little poof and the studs. So yeah, it's a super cute one. Another Betsyville one that I have here is this one. It's like a little, kind of like a baguette. It's really cute. A um, lot of detail to this bag in particular. All the little patches. I love the little I Heart New York and the peace sign. It's like a checkered print. Kind of like a New York City bag. And just small on the inside. has a front pocket. Yeah, this one, I don't quite remember. I think I got it online, but I just really loved all of the little patches. And it's just kind of a quirky little bag, so... Love that. Um, <laughs> this is another one I bought off of Kim. Um, she, you really should check her out. She, if you love purses, she is awesome. Um, this is such a cute bag. So I haven't used this one yet. You'll hear that a lot with my purses. I kind of buy them and then I wear them when... I feel like wearing them and like I have the perfect outfit in mind or I'm just in the mood for that bag but super cute. See the glare is really bad again but I love the stripes and the pink and the little fur ball is so cute. Um, middle compartment. All of the interiors are always so unique in her bags which I love. It's got a front compartment zipper compartment and then another zipper compartment in the back so yeah this is super cute and the front here it looks like it'd be two pockets but it's actually just one big pocket and those two snaps magnetic closures so yeah super cute have a backpack purse here. This is such a cute one. I got this this summer from Marshalls and um, I love it. It's so cute. I love the rose pattern and you know, got the white and the black and it actually it's very, I have some stuff in there, but it's very spacious. It's got the rose pattern on the inside. Um, I think I only paid $20 for this one too because it was on clearance. The most I probably spent was 25 but I'm pretty sure I only paid 20 for this. Here is this cutie tootie tote bag. Oh, sorry. I can't fix that real quick. It's not so obvious. Um, I got this one offline too. I'm pretty sure I only paid $20 for this one. So cute. I love the little lock and the bow, but I love this pattern. I wore this one there again this summer. Hot pink straps. There again, kind of a unique interior. It's like light pink with the roses. Has two front compartments and a zipper. So yeah, I love the large totes that she makes too because you can use them for so many different things. Like, you know, you can use it for school or work or whatever and you have plenty of room and it's a stylish bag. I love this one. This one is so cute. This is one of the first bags that I bought off of Kim on Purse Trippin' um, during one of her live sales. It is so adorable. It is Betsyville. There again. All of the cute little patches on this. I can't really see that one. Let me see little hair dryer, the lips, the nail polish. It's just so cute. I couldn't pass this up. So adorable. And then like the handle has got this really pretty lace. There again, I bought this one this summer, used it this summer. It was perfect size. Really cute. Went with a lot of cute outfits and stuff. 
this one I actually need to fix the zipper because it came off um, but it's this little backpack this one is another one that's the love Betsy you can usually tell um, well you'll be able to tell because it says love Betsy in the bag but also the love Betsy's typically have like I said in my first video the striped and the star um, interiors but yeah this is so cute it's got little unicorns and rainbows and a big heart I thought that was so cute but it has like a heart um, gold heart zip around thing and it actually broke off so I need to fix that still but I haven't gotten around to it and I just it goes with that on top of the gold but um I just haven't gotten around to it and I'll get to it eventually I guess kind of thing I will procrastinate this just fell out of my bag this is um this is a little thing I use um you can put it like at the end of a table and um, hang your bag up so you don't have to put it on the ground. Um, I think it's a really clever idea. I carry it with me sometimes in my bags. If it would close, I'll, I'll fix it later. But it's really nice and comes in handy. I think I got that off AliExpress and probably didn't spend more than a dollar on it. So yeah, pretty nice. Um, this is another one that I got off purse tripping like half my bags came off purse tripping apparently but this one is so cute it's just a tote another tote I have a problem with totes apparently but it's this really pretty um tan and brown I love the bow and then the interior is like the little chat bubble things and it says things like you're hot sweetie rocket two front compartments and then the zip pocket so cute I'm telling you guys she finds like the cutest bags so if you love Betsy Johnson I would totally recommend her because she always finds like really cute and unique ones but um she also finds just like high-end bags she gets dupes all that sort of stuff and they're really well priced um and you normally she usually does free shipping um, unless she's doing like a, like a $10 bag sale where you have to pay for some shipping, but it's, it's not expensive at all. And she's awesome. Really, really great. I can't I keep talking about her, but she's really awesome. I found so many cute bags. Um, I found a lot of my Betsy's from her, so I appreciate her. Um, this is another one I got off her. This is another... Betsyville with I loved this heart it's like a purple satin I kind of call it like the winter winter coat jacket purse because it kind of reminds me of that but yeah Betsyville zipper compartment two front compartments just a big drop super cute and then the zipper is like a little lightning bolt love that I, she gave me she gave me a really good deal on that because I also got a wallet included with that, which I could show you guys my Betsy wallets, or at least some of them, because there again I could have some in storage, but it was, she gave it to me for free pretty much um, when I purchased it. So she does cool stuff like that all the time too. <coughs> Here is another. This one's so cute, I love. Betsy is just so good because it's like, they add in like cute quirky stuff that makes stuff like on their purse is really unique so you know that cute stripe with the florals it's just like a great pop and then it's a crossbody as well if you want it to be I usually wear my bags crossbody or you can just hold it you know you can wear it like that or hold it in your hand really great quality bags here oh there's something in there but um that's the chat bubble kind of interior again so three different sections to put your stuff and then, yeah, really cute one. Okay. Here's another one. This one's really cute, too. I love the shape of this one. Of course, it's all bend up. There again, like, this is my closet. There we go. Um, it's kind of like, almost like, just... 
it's not long at all it's more wide um, I love the nameplate on this one it's really pretty and then like the little keychain long crossbody strap the quilted hearts I just love it when she has the quilted hearts oh I didn't even notice it had a little diamond thing on it that's really pretty and it's like a heart it's really cool then on the inside it looks like this and then how you close this one is it's not like a snap closure or anything you take this little hook thing and you just hook it shut um so yeah if you're one of those people though that likes to have like your bag zippered and everything i wouldn't recommend that one but <laughs> i think it's kind of a cool closure okay and yet another this one is so cute i love her big um bow purses really pretty it's kind of like a um a pleather kind of look to it they're gonna have stuff in it. i really need to clean my bags up this interior is a little different than all the other ones with the, it's kind of like almost like a light blue with the roses. She always has roses, which I love too. <laughs> and yeah, cross strap as well. So yeah, that's really cute. I have another one like this one I'm about to show you, but I don't know where it is. It might be in storage, but um, this little cutie. <laughs> it's from the Trolls movie. I never saw this movie, but she made stuff for um that I guess like based off of it but this was so cute with the fur and it's like a little just a little almost like a canteen crossbody yeah that's what it's called canteen and um just simple if I was just going out and I wasn't going to take that much with me I would totally carry this I love how quirky and unique it is see that's like why I love her so much she makes such quirky and unique stuff she has more basic things kind of like this that first tote I showed you, but then she like makes crazy stuff like this. So it's like, how can you not love her? I have this really, really tiny purse. I have not used this yet. I guess I didn't realize like how small this bag was, but there again, if I was just going out and I didn't need a ton, I guess I could take this one, but it's, it's really tiny. There again, love Betsy. Um, just like the pink heart, I liked the stripes, there's the interior, and it does have a crossbody strap, so, more of a basic one. I have yet another backpack, I, I love this backpack, it is so freaking cute, um, the black and the white, but this zipper is what sold me, this, this is the chain. And then it's got this cute little heart. And this is a fully functioning zipper, which is pretty cool. So you can put stuff in there and then you know, just zip it shut. And it's so cute. I have a couple of things in there, so I'm not going to really open it up. But um, I can show you what the, there again, just the basic interior of all of her bags are. But so freaking cute. This is probably like one of my favorite ones that I have by her and there again this is one I got it from Marshalls and it was only $20 because it went down that low so I got this one and the first one that I showed you at the same time and they were both like $40 which is how much like well in fact like it'd be even more than that originally retailed for a Betsy bag so can't pass that up like check out Marshalls and stuff because they really do get really inexpensive stuff after a while. I mean, it's inexpensive as it begins with, but like, especially when the markdowns keep going down, it will go lower. So it's like, I definitely recommend that. Okay. I have another one kind of like this, but there again, it's in storage. <laughs> I'm going to have to see if I can get them down eventually for you guys, but this is just stuff I have on the inside, but, um, this is super cute. It's, I call this my Valentine's Day purse. I used it for Valentine's Day this year, but it's so cute. Just a small little bag, you know, kind of in the style of some of like the Michael Kors, 
Steve Madden's that, you know, you got your Betsy and dad and even has, you know, the Steve Madden's have this little plate like this. But yeah, this is so cute. Crossbody. Another one that I think I got from Marshalls. I think I paid $15 for this and I got the other one at the same time. So I only paid like 30 bucks for both of them, which is a steal and super cute. Um, this one, really I wouldn't consider it a purse. I bought this offline, but I think it's more of a cosmetic case, which it's still really cute. Um, it's got little skulls and the roses. The reason why I think it's cosmetic is because it's a little mirror too. And the handles, I mean, you can't hit, you know, you can't hold that. So it's like, so I could take it with me like on a trip or something and put my toiletries and stuff in it. But just like that on the inside, still super cute. Okay, this is a super cute one too. I love nautical stuff. So when I saw this one, I was like, I have to have it. I think I got this one. Maybe. Probably Macari. I love Macari too. Um, this is so freaking cute. It's like white, blue, and that red, and the little handles got the studs, and then you can, it's mostly a shoulder bag, but it's so cute. <laughs> like, I really, really like this a lot. Um, there again, probably one of my favorite ones that I've bought. I'm sure I have others there again that I would probably, I probably could say that about every single Betsy bag that I buy. It's like, I just love them. There again, you got the front compartment, middle zipper, back, and then it has a zipper pocket in the back as well. So, stay. Okay, so this is the last one that I have. So it's just this one. Really basic one, but I love this giant bow. So pretty. Can't really have that glare so bad. But it's so cute. And then the inside is just the little chat bubble things again. That's so cute. And I love one of my favorite things when I get a Betsy bag. I love when I see that the zipper pulls the little heart. I think that is so cute. And I love the little attention to detail she does. But yeah, so I got this one. Yeah, so... That's quite a bit. I'll show you guys my pile here. So there's the pile on the bed, and then there's the um, pile on the floor too, which I guess I didn't get a very good shot of, of that, but um, let me set you guys back down. Ooh. Okay, so thanks for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I have way too many Betsy purses. I should just like rename my channel to the Betsy lover or something, Betsy girl. Um, sorry, I thought I heard something. So, yeah, um, that's the end of my video. Um, <laughs> just kind of sitting here. Um, let me know if you guys like this. Give me a thumbs up. If you want to leave me a comment, that'd be cool too. Um, seriously consider checking out Kim on, per on Purse Trippin. She's awesome. I really do recommend her a lot. She has such good deals. <laughs> like, half of my bags were from her, and I'm sure I have more somewhere else. That I don't just buy exclusively Betsy from her. I've bought other stuff from her, too. Um, she gets a lot of, um, really cute ones. So, yeah. Um, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.